Again, the players take a knee to support the Black Lives Matter movement. And we begin a crucial game on a crucial evening at the bottom. It's going to be Emmy Wendia to bend one. And it's touched away well. Ben Foster with the first real save of the game and doing it very smartly. It's a good effort going for that far side, but I think he's got it covered all the way, really. Ben Foster is quite comfortable. It's going to his favoured hand, to his left hand side, so it was a comfortable stop. Off goes Hernandez again. That's good, strong play again from Hernandez. And Norwich in the red shirts uh, making options here. Wendir is one of them. And he's worked aside. A goal on the left. Oh. Wonderful strike. And Norwich City have finally got themselves a goal in the restart. What a goal for Daniel Farkas' side. Bent in beautifully by Emi Buendia. That was a great strike, but Hernandez made, made all the running here. And it's for many again. Look, it's too casual defending. He's already got done once on that right-hand side. Norwich is left, but he's bundled out of it again by Hernandez. And then he comes over and it comes to Buendia. And he cuts back, chops back onto his left side. That's a good chop. The Cena doesn't get close enough and a great finish going for that far off corner. Super goal. And it comes deep. Oh, it's over Kroll and then by Dawson. A simple goal and Watford a level. A lovely set piece and they didn't mark on the far post. Craig Dawson gets Watford second since the restart. Well, I go back to the free kick. You're giving away a cheap free kick and then you can't defend free kicks. Look, it's a free header for Dawson. He's more or less a yard out from goal and just putting it into the goal. Yeah, sure, he's finished it well and it's a decent cross from Kapu from the free kick. But what a cheap goal to give away. That's the story of the Norwich season. Giving a cheap free kick away when in possession and then from the free kick, they don't defend it properly. They get bullied and they're back at 1-1. We've only just had 10 minutes and two goals at Vicarage Road. Any time you get your head on the ball, it's really going to whiz into that net with the pace already on it. So nice flat ball that's required. They've had a succession from that side. Watford, it's flicked on by Welbeck. And Norwich have dealt with it out as far as Ducouré. He just guides it to Dawson. Great area from Will Hughes, wasn't it? Just needed the flick. I think the keeper did well there. Well, here's that corner that came in. It was a lovely flat corner. You can see Welbeck just gets there. And there's Tim Krull just getting a knee on it. Lovely corner. All it needs is that little glance. It does, but Krull reacts in time. Vrancic flicked through for Puki. Up to wrong foot, Ben Foster. Good little ball from Vrancic. It was poked into him from Godfrey, you could see here. Look, just sits himself in there in between the lines. Nice little position, little poke through to, to Puki, and that's the one where he's really good. The Norwich have now moved it a little quicker and as a result they've got really good position here with Lewis and Hernandez fires one, good block that by Cavasele and a great save too from Foster Stieperman fields it for Norwich City who've had the first real chance then of this second period when Dia goes again and goes too high It's a lot better from Norwich, much more direct, a lot quicker isn't it into the break and you can see as the ball comes out wide there was a good block in here. Comes out wide and he's just pulled back. That's a good pick out. And I think that's Dawson just got his block in there. And then Foster with a save of his feet. Two good stops by Watford, but very good movement from Norwich as well. Picking out the players with the crosses. Those cutbacks can be lethal. And Watford looked to break with Saar. He's got the benefit of that one against McClay. And still Saar with two coming up to join him. Saar into the middle, and Welbeck on the overhead. Oh, how about that? Incredible goal from Danny Welbeck. It sat beautifully. He knew what he wanted to do. He executed it brilliantly. A first Premier League goal for Norwich for Watford. And how big could that be? Oh, it's a great finish from Danny Welbeck. It's the first time they played the ball wide to Saar early. You can see they break the attack up and it comes out early from De Cure, and now he's got a run. And he shows that pace, he shows that strength, he's brushed the defender apart. Then all of a sudden, this isn't the best cross, but it deflects up awkwardly for Danny Welbeck. But what a finish. He knows exactly what he wants to do and he executes it perfectly. That is a real difficult skill, made to look real easy with a great bit of technique from Danny Welbeck. What a finish. Great quick break on the right-hand side, flicks up for Welbeck. Oh, 
great finish. One of the goals of the season, I think. Super athleticism and super technique to match as well. Right in the top corner from Danny Welbeck. Well, if you're going to break your duck, what a way to do it. And how big a goal could that be for Watford this season? But still holding that line, it's a, a deeper one. Dini's won it really well, down to Cleverly. Straight at the goalkeeper. Good at that, Tom Cleverly. He knows immediately that ball's gone into Dini. I'm going to get in and around him, I'm going to get close. He's hoisted up to the far post. Just get within five yards of him. Look, there's the clever little run. Makes himself a yard, but it's straight down the throat of Cruel. But it's better. Norwich free kick then. Could be a decent one from Buendia. And over the top it goes from Brancic, who got free on the near post. Well, he's in acres of space, there's no one marking. Look, he just drifts into the area. Look, for many, he's not even aware of him coming across him. Welbeck as well, the second man in the space. No one attacks the ball. And really, just needed to help it on its way, and he got a little bit too much on it. Buendia picks up the second ball. Now they do find Jamal Lewis. Glanced across goal! Oh, and it's gone wide somehow. Ida launched himself at it on the far post and couldn't get the right connection. How did he miss that, John? I mean, the ball came in from this right-hand side. The Kure got caught in possession, being too intricate in there. As the ball comes in, there's a little touch there. That's got to be a goal. He's come off the side of his foot and he's gone wide. He's like he's trying to open himself up. Just get anything behind it. Oh, harder to miss. Harder to miss that one. One of the chances of the season. Really should have got something behind it, the young man. Oh, that could be huge. Rancic to Godfrey. Again, everybody squeezing play inside the Watford half. But there it is. There's the full-time whistle, a sigh of relief from Nigel Pearson. And a huge three points for Watford. For Norwich City, it was not to be again away from home. After taking the lead, it's Watford who come back to win and move themselves four points clear of the relegation zone and what a goal to win it to Danny Welbeck's overhead kick something quite special in the second half after 1-1 at half time when Dawson and Wendy exchange goals while Watford celebrate Norwich City know that that might be the final chance of final chances full time at Vicarage Road it is Watford 2, Norwich City 1. Hey, click here for more videos.